In a group of 23 randomly chosen people, the probability that at least two people share the same birthday is greater than 50%. So today we actually want to show that this is true. So we can see that at first the problem is very difficult because there's a lot of cases to consider because um, let's say I share the same birthday as person A and person A could share the same birthday as person B so me, person A and person B, we could all share the same birthday and because it's at least two people so and also all of the 23 people can also share the same birthday so there's a lot of cases to consider so however if you break this down by looking at the complementary events then the complement of at least two people share the same birthday would be no one has the same birthday so it would be one minus that now person one's birthday can land on any day out of the 365 days so it equals to 365 out of 365 Person two's birthday can land on th um, 364 days out of 365, apart from that one particular day, um, that person, which is person one's birthday. So that's why it's 364 out of 365. Now, person three cannot have the same birthday as person one and person two. That's why it's um, 363 out of 365 and etc. Person 23 cannot have the same birthday as the previous 23 people so that's why it can only land on 343 days out of the 365 days. Now no 23 people have the same birthday so what is the probability of that? Which is the probability that of person 1's birthday multiplied by the probability of person 2's birthday etc to person 23 which is the product of what we have on the top. Now on the denominator it's easy to see it's 365 to the power of 23 and on our numerator it's just product of what, what numbers we have on the top. So um, now how can we simplify our numerator? Now we can Break this down into 365 factorial over 342 factorial or over 365 to the power of 23. If you, if you evaluate this number on your calculator, it will return a mass error because the memory in our calculator is not big enough. So we need to use algebra to simplify this expression further. Now, 342 can be broken down into 365 minus 23 factorial. If you remember from permutation, NPR is equal to N factorial over N minus R factorial. So, linking this with what we have on the top, 365 factorial over 365 minus 23 factorial is exactly equal to 365p23. So hence this is equal to 365p23 over 365 to the power of 23. So from before, we found that the probability that no one has the same birthday is equal to 365p23 or over 365 to the power of 23. So let's evaluate this on your calculator. Let's see what we have. We can actually and that's equal to 0 0.507293. Two nine seven two three four. So which is equal to fifty point seven percent, which is more than fifty percent that at least two people will share the same birthday out of twenty three random uh, randomly chosen people in a room.